you know anything and everything can come in the exam so make sure you are doing the entire syllabus area and you know make sure in those days you are just revising everything whatever you have studied solve enough questions especially if it's a practical exam it is give a mock exam you know don't take too much stress that okay tomorrow is my exam so i need to let's say uh, revise everything again or i have to solve this many questions you know keeping an eye on that clock yes time management is very important in ecc exam right are you giving your ecc exam in this june 23 attempt well then i ecc disha chauhan have some tips for you keep on watching this video to know about that hi everyone so if you are attempting to give your exam this june 23 attempt here are a few things that you must keep in your mind number one is that you are completing your entire syllabus don't leave anything behind don't think that okay i don't find this topic interesting so i should not do it you know anything and everything can come in the exam so make sure you are doing the entire syllabus area make sure you're watching the revision sessions or you know if you are with us you would have a revision session question marathon session so fintram provides with a video question marathon revision session so make sure you watch that if you are studying let's say on your own or you know through someone else still keep time for revision keep few days for revision and you know make sure in those days you are just revising everything whatever you have studied make sure you solve enough questions especially if it's a practical exam it is very important that you solve enough questions even if it's a theory exam you still need to go through a lot of questions right because if you don't solve many questions you will end up getting quite confused in your exam Another important tip is definitely give a mock exam. Giving a mock exam is very important because not only you are giving an exam in those time frame, right? Your time management will also come into action, but also you will understand then where you went wrong, what could you do better, so that you don't repeat those mistakes in your actual exam day. Then on your exam day or a day before your exam day, firstly let's take, talk about that. You know, don't take too much stress that okay uh, tomorrow is my exam, so I need to let's say uh, revise everything again or I have to solve this many questions. You know, if you are keeping many things on your last day, then you know you probably not done good preparation. So on your last day, you should be just revising, let's say few things, maybe solving one or two questions here and there, and not. doing like full 20 hours of study or something like that because next day you have exams so your mind needs to be fresh so on your just a day before your exam you know don't keep a lot of things that i have to do this i have to do that i have to practice this you know keep things minimal on the day of your exam make sure you're eating something before the exam so that your energy is there and during the exam you then don't start feeling hungry or tired so even if you you know some people don't like to eat before exam but make sure you're having something so that you have that energy even if it's a chocolate or maybe a fruit or you're just drinking some milk so make sure you do that now on the day of exam when you're giving your exam make sure you're keeping an eye on that clock yes time management is very important in ecc exam right especially at your skills and professional level it becomes utmost important there are so many students who have done everything you know who have done uh, all the completed the syllabus who have revised done questions but they are not able to tackle the time they are taking too much time because maybe they have not practiced enough so when you practice enough you know when you have studied uh, in these past few months regularly when you have practiced enough when you have you know done our question marathon and all of that then you will have that confidence and you will probably are not so lacking behind that time management issue so that's why it's important and that's why i said mock exam is also very important so keep a eye on the clock when you're giving an exam uh, if you are unable to solve a question don't waste too much time on that move on move on to the next question and come back on it later when you have let's say done the entire paper so here are some tips for you i hope these are helpful and i wish you all the very best for your june 23 attempt you know you have now prepared so just you know just study whatever remaining things are there just revise and stay calm don't take too much stress it's just an exam at the end of the day and i'm sure if you have prepared well you will definitely clear it so all the very best for your june 23 attempt